I'm traveling to 60 countries for 16 months. We've been to Ireland, we've been to the UK, and now we're finally in Switzerland. 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 Switz, 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 Switz. Went to Paris for less than a day. Flew in from London. Paris was annoying because I couldn't find the hostel. When I found the hostel, there was no key. There's no like reception desk, there's nothing. So I didn't know how to get in my fucking room. So I just booked a hotel for the night. I was like, fuck it, $80. Best sleep I've gotten in like the whole trip. I had my own shower, okay, and my own toilet, and it was nice, and I enjoyed being there. Paris did not smell like piss. I didn't explore too much of the city, so I could be wrong about that. I imagine other places do smell like piss. Then went to the Eiffel Tower. The next day, woke up, checked out, went to Zurich, and yeah, roll the montage. Now I'm here, um, living la vida loca. This is like my first full day in Zurich. Travel day was rough, but I'm going to Dinner Express right now, which is like the cheapest groceries. Just relaxing though. Really nice hostel, really, really nice hostel. Best hostel I've been in. It held yesterday. I didn't get much footage, but I put it on my story on Instagram. Got work done this morning. We're chilling. It's right over here. Wait. Dinner. I just spent $35 and probably four days worth of food. So we saved more money in Zurich than we did in other countries. I think it makes up for the overall like much we spent on like accommodation. 55 a night, it beats 80 a night, you know? Which is still pretty like, okay, not cheap, but better. One other thing, I would like to thank you guys significantly for how well the first video of the Digital Nomad tour did. Almost 500 views in a week, which is my best performing video by far. I wanna check the analytics on that. Like again, thank you. From the bottom of my heart, like it means so much that you guys like the video. Just seeing the view count on it, I know numbers aren't everything, but like when you're starting off, like get, seeing good numbers is very motivating. Headed down to Prime Tower. Um, little miscalculation on the price of groceries. It was actually 25 francs conversion on screen. Four days worth of food. So yeah, we're headed down to Prime Tower. Both ways before crossing the road. Okay, we're chilling. I gotta cut down on a few supplies here. I don't know what supplies I'm gonna cut down on, but we'll figure it out. We'll figure out what I don't need and what I do need, and we'll just get rid of it. I tried getting rid of the drone. Most people would say it's not a smart idea, but the weight of the charger and everything, it adds up. I'm probably gonna get rid of a lot of clothes. Uh, speaking of which, I gotta actually throw my stuff in the laundry tonight. I'm also gotta work on the cork video, which is a cinematic piece and then i gotta get like the london footage in paris footage in zurich footage in we got quite the day ahead of us let me give you the quick itinerary for today prime tower limat flussbad museum house and then after that we'll head back something i discovered recently is i thought that america and a few other countries were the only ones that drove on the right side of the road but it's actually the other way around most countries do drive on the correct side of the road which is good to know, you know, like they actually listened um, to us, you know, the people that invented the fucking car. Just a cool looking area, to be honest, just a vibe, just a good vibe. 
Yeah, I think I'm gonna take some video, some cinematic shots. We'll get a little cinematic footage here. I'll be right back. Peace. At this point, I don't even know where the fuck I am. I'm just kind of wandering. Um, I'm just kind of having a good time. <laughs> just, just exploring this random part of the city where there's like no people. Yeah, just shooting, shooting pictures, video, living life. Good shit. I don't know if you can see that in the distance. Disc golf. Did I bring my discs? No, I didn't. To be honest, I did not. Tower. I think it was just a restaurant at the top. It's no observatory. We're going to Limplatz. 10 hour by public transport. 19 minutes by walking. I'll do public transport just to save time. Get as much as we can done in one day, you know? Keep you updated. <laughs> Little bit car-y sounding because there's a lot of cars who would have thought but yeah lima Platz was just a train station or a tram station we're moving on to the next place which is called flusbad operletten some shit like that keep you updated i might hit that bridge up actually we're gonna check out what the hell the flu spot is or whatever it's fucking called pretty chill spot honestly so i'm walking over to the bridge that I mentioned earlier. Pretty good journey so far. We're on day 20. Pretty good. I mean, it's flying by. I won't lie. Just thinking about how long Japan was. Japan was 35 days. We're almost there. So we're about to beat our current best time. I'll be in Turkey. That's when I'll beat my current best. We're at a water treatment plant right now. I haven't seen any fish in this water, but I feel like it'd be a good spot to fish, right? Right? It was supposed to rain today. I'm very glad it didn't, simply because I get to walk around now and explore. Because the first day I was here, I got work, I got this shit, I got this shit, I got this shit, I got this shit. You know what I'm saying? Another ultimate hangout spot right down here. A little bit dirty, nonetheless, pretty fucking cool. Next, we're going to Museum House Constructive. 24 minutes away by public transport, 33 minutes by walking. We're going to do public transportation. Oh yeah, a little life hack. They don't check if you buy tickets or not. For legal purposes, I'm gonna say I do buy tickets. Yeah. to the next stop museum house constructive uh, i guess there's different they do use different buildings throughout the year or each year something about electricity or some shit but seems pretty cool used to be an electric house or some sort i don't fucking know but this seems cool let's check it out i don't know what that was we just go upstairs i guess Pretty interesting uh, artwork to say the least. 
Off to the next place, fix my hair there. Okay, we just finished the museum. Great vibe reset, you know? Next stop is Schanzengraben. So, we're going there. Pretty chill spot, another very, very chill spot. Um, recommend. First, we're going to Benhofstrasse. Not sure if I pronounced that right. And then uh, Lindenhof. We'll do that really quick and then we're gonna call it a day after that, actually. Peace. <laughs>